tell we are getting festive today so today i am taking you around shopping i have a list of stuff that i need to get done christmas gifts but also we are doing um, a room makeover christmas decor obviously not getting a lot of new stuff but basically um, i'm gonna take you guys around i want to just get out of my bedroom so it's a bit different this time um so yeah hopefully you like it keep watching if you want to see this vlog Havre mjölk om ni hörde det. 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 Vi har soja, vi har äkta, vi har kokos. Jag provar med kokos då. Mm. En mellanstor del. Det vi har ju lite något annat. Ja, den större då. Är det bra så? Ja. Ta med. Vad sa du? Ta med eller sitta här. Eh, ta med snälla. Ta. Got my coffee in its cute little Christmas mug. Uh, they only had a size small or large, so go big or go home, baby. Hmm. Also, they completely renovated this mall. It looks so nice. Look at the tiles on the floor. That herringbone like pattern. Anyways, as you can see, no one in Sweden wears a mask. Um, so yeah, first stop is Hemtex. I need to find a Christmas pillowcase, pretty much. Hold up, I am on my way. I'm in motion. Let's go to the ocean. Yeah, let's go outside. We can hang out on the beach without freezing. Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas time. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time. Doesn't matter if the Lager House is literally one of my favorite stores. They have so many cute things for Christmas. And here they have some nice, like, wrapping paper and things to, like, wrap your gifts with. So I'm gonna get some of those. How cute is this guy? Oh, here we go. I want some fake palms like this but like really tall so i'm gonna ask if they have longer ones mm, they don't really have any nice pillowcases there was one that had a little bit of green in it the kind of christmas dark green that i'm looking for but nothing that stood out so i'm just gonna keep looking show you guys these two gifts they're probably the most inconvenient gifts to carry because now i can't film i actually need both of my hands but let me show you one second i'm gonna put you down but first things first let's carry these gifts back to the car and then come back again right brb guys you're going in my pocket so so far this is the only green large face that I've seen that would probably work with what I picture. Now that I'm in the clothing section, it makes me think, what am I gonna wear for Christmas? Um, I don't know about you guys, but we always dress up in our family. Like we go all out, make sure it feels super festive and like you're going to a party. <laughs> 
it is 2 20 and the sun is setting welcome to sweden in winter time next and final stop is basically another store called yisk um, that sell more affordable sorts of prices so hopefully i can find something there take you guys with me please make sure they have it oh yes i think they might do oh i love their stuff I feel like this Santa has cheeks like mine. It's like they spell your name. It's insane. This one's more expensive than the one from H&M, but I kind of prefer it. So I found what I was looking for. Basically, this is what I've been looking for everywhere. Success! Let's go home and restyle my room. For the first project, I saw this snow flower advent star that Nordic Nest were selling online, literally made from paper. And I immediately thought, I can make that. They even have a version for £91, which is outrageous. So I'm going to show you how to make it using good old baking paper that you probably have for free in stock at home. Folding a piece of paper in half is the easiest way to draw a curve and make a stencil. Use this to trace out the shape onto your baking paper and then fold a fan-like pattern evenly by flipping each sheet like this. Once you've done this, you fold the piece in half and simply glue together the top part which turns it into a cute heart shape. These become the petals for your snow flower, which you glue together and let dry. For some reason, this baking paper worked best with a stickier glue rather than a glue gun. I made this countdown to Christmas sort of advent calendar, which I ended up scrapping, but I thought I'd share it with you guys anyways. As an alternative, you could even pin up mini envelopes or Polaroid pictures from each day. But instead, I really wanted to create two paintings that linked together. So my idea was trees on a snowy mountain to reflect the colors in the bed sheets that I'm going to swap to. Acrylic paint is super easy to use with lots of water. You blend out the paint and you can easily achieve a watercolor type of effect. I always like to start light and build. And for these paintings, I wanted a minimal, more simple look rather than detailed. I am obsessed with this English tea advent calendar my mom got me this year. I mean, who doesn't love a cup of tea every day to warm up the soul? And I had the brilliant idea to reuse the open boxes and make a garland. I'm so proud of this one. Tree cones are a very easy DIY to make using whatever string or material you have at home. I used leftover yarn and macrame and stickers. I mean, you could even glue on sweets or pine cones, go wild and use anything that would fit with your decor style.
So I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did making it. And if you did, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Also, let me know how you guys celebrate Christmas and what you do to make your space feel more festive. I have probably said festive a million times in this video, but it's fine because that's what we're trying to get into. What I really wanted to show you guys is that you don't need to spend a lot of money to make a space in a home feel different. Also, I made it a challenge to use what I already had at home, which forces you to be creative. And that was a lot of fun. And changing bed sheets and changing artwork is literally the smallest thing, but it goes a long way. I'm sending lots of love to the rest of the world, wherever you are. And I hope you guys have a beautiful, warm Christmas with your families. Till my next video. See you guys in the next one. People say happy holidays. Happy holiday. Happy holidays. <laughs>